Well, hello there, and good afternoon. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP, and here playing Crusader Kings 2, North Sea Dorama, episode 246, where hopefully we'll get the achievement. We're at 36% war score, 26% of our possible occupation, 0% of battles. I don't know why. I guess we haven't actually battled the Mongols yet, have we? We have not seen a Mongolian army. It's really weird, actually. We're fighting a bunch of other wars. We're no longer lustful. It wasn't really that big a problem for us, honestly. We're trying to smash everything we can at this stage of the game. New. G U, yes. You. Uh so that occupation hurts me here. Here. Sarpa and Orium. It doesn't hurt me here. That's fine. I can deal with that. Uh, you're gonna get the war score, taking war score back. Lost control of Sarpa. I guess I own land out here too, huh? That's Mongolian. That's why is it flip? Yeah, I don't know. Don't know. Don't want to know. Don't care to know. Don't. Don't. Doesn't matter. Apparently I'm not all worth the busy emperor, but I've barely even seen his ass. I guess I better get my men out there. As long as you stay in your land. At this point, the Pope's just waiting game. I feel. Yeah, I know I was gonna lose that. But meanwhile, they're about to lose a shit ton of men. of Saxony's longer than Germania, but it's Germanic. Yes, it is. I control all of Uyghur. I mean, it might really just be like, do I leave the game on for like an hour and let the taking war score do its job, or what? Like, are there Mongols out there to fight, even? Starting to wonder. Click the button. Fuck it. Rather than suffer over supply limit. Church assets plundered. Who knew? I'm building forts in all of these too, buddy. Like, y'all are not weaseling me out of anything. Ooh, that's personally held land. That could be important. Is that important? Does this matter? This is Kumul. Kumul counts. Yeah, baby. Alright, now I gotta wait to rack up some war score. Good, fight the rebels. That's what I want you to do. That's exactly it. 1715, this is the closest fight we've had in a while. We have many more heavy infantry, however. And we have better commanders by, like, an infinite margin. My daughter is going to kick the shit out of them. Like, no joke, smash time. He's gonna reinforce into it, but it's gonna be a bad idea. He might even reinforce, yep, right into a death trap. That was worth five war score. Yep. Okay, well, whatever. I mean, you know. Just, uh... Keep doing what you do, I guess. Go beat that up. The Emperor's like, Har, I've got some of your land. I'm about to be like, Ha, I've got your face. And a vice, like a Joe Pesci movie. After you guys get done with this, maybe you go help out against the Emperor. Nah, yeah, you go south and take more Mongol land. Better yet. When this fort finishes. Send you 10,000 to go not do that. That's not the old Mongol sign. That's the Mongols. That's the Mongols themselves. Well, if I go up to 12, it's costing me money at this point, but what do I care?
He's like, I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> I'm like, did I say you had a choice? Polican, wow, Polican. Would not have seen that coming. Orthodox. Orthodoxy. Orthodox got out here? That's pretty good, man. You did a good job, guys. I'm impressed. I mean, I'm not, but you know. It felt like a nice thing to say, and, and you weren't doing so high. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's bad. Um. Ten thousand I can throw at this. It's Andalusian. Actually, since I can get him there faster. I wanna bring you, I wanna bring you, and I wanna bring you. If I took the family focus right now, that would really not be out of character for this character, to be honest. Surprised he's beating me. I'm really surprised he beat me. That's unfortunate. That matters. Like I'm not gonna deny it. That that hurt a little. Those are my feels. But he's about to face 19, 12, or something. So he can have his little victory. That's all right. It's okay. How's the Pope? Uh, are you even in the war against me? No. None of you idiots are. That's why you're not worth it. Just run the clock out on this stupid thing. Are you really gonna make me? Okay, but maybe I don't want that open. Have you ever considered that? Game. <sighs> Whatever, okay. So I do need maybe an organizer in that army, just to get there in time. I know the business vampire is like, I'm going to stop you from winning this war. No, you're not. Um... Hey, he converted religions. Hey, he's a crappy soldier. Whatever, he's a guy. Pope's at 98. Mongol Empire won its revolt war. 67, baby. One bad battle that we made back up in the 2% war score difference. Oh, please come up here piecemeal, please. Be so happy if you did. The Pope just let me piece him the hell out already? No, I'm losing, but I won't give up yet. About I, I'm bleeding from every orifice thanks to everything you've done to me. And I haven't figured out how to say no, I don't want to lose. 81. Oh my god. Oh my god. I see it coming. I see it. I see it. It's in my future. I'm going to win it. I'm going to get it. <laughs> man, I'm amped. You don't know, man. You don't know. This has been months in the making, and... 
I'm feeling very, very happy right now. I'm not gonna lie. The Pope is like, all right, fuck it. You can have my remaining moral authority. The crusade for Lombardy fails. Jesus, it seems, does not favor the Christian faithful. After a string of defeats and setbacks, Pope Marinus III is called off the crusade for Lombardy against Filker Zwerker. Well. What does that leave for you, Mr. Mongol? So... Still hostile to most of these tags. Um, he won't surrender for no goddamn reason. I could just wipe peace and be done with it, and I've accomplished what I wanted to do with this war, but I'm fucking greedy. If this works. I kinda want all my commanders back right about now. Hmm, I see what he might be trying to do. Okay. It's not a bad idea, even. I'm never going to let him do it, but it's not a bad idea for him to try to sneak back in through here. It's a pretty freaking clever idea, actually, and it's really... Did I just discover that terrain? Okay, Frost, you're about to get a major achievement, and you just learned something basic about the structure of the game. One wonders how well you were trained in the first place. One marvels at the fact you really weren't. Better Castle Town? I'll spend the points for that. Points? Did I say points? Like monarch points? No, 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 no. Such, such a thing cannot be existent in this game. Um, I want to pause because before I engage the Emperor, I really need fucking commanders here. And I don't know where mine are, and that's kind of a problem. I mean, that's literally the best problem I could possibly have, but it's a problem. Thirteen on eight, but I want the best in the business, baby. She's aggressive and heavy infantry. Oh god, I want to watch this. I mean, I'm gonna cross a major river. I don't want to do this. Um, what are they saying about this province now? Is there somehow, like, not a river crossing here? River flows between here and Sap Sarpa. Oh, I'm like the wrong thing. Sarkel, but not Don Portage. So, beatings commence shortly. Meanwhile, what's he trying to do? This little slippery motherfucker. I, I saw your move, pal. I'm pushing this. Ninety-five. Ninety-five. He 
won't give up. It's gonna be tough. But I think we're reaching the conclusion of this campaign. So, P.S., the Byzantines never had a chance. They had a pretty good general for a moment there. But, they never had a chance. I do need the gold, but I don't want your gold. Because that would be really stupid of me. Why would I ever do that? Uh-huh. Need 11 days? The fact that I need 11 days is sad. So they're not trying anything stupid on me. I think they're trying to get me to walk into something, but it's not happening. Uh, huh? 14, I'll play that button. Ninety-nine. Still ninety-nine. Less than 36 months have passed, and I still have not won a battle, but he'll accept. Even I got 2% from a battle earlier. Oh my. So I don't see an achievement. Um, I'm going to create a paint file. And... Holy War... How do I spell this without offending Shank? If you get the joke, you know what I'm talking about. Uyghur win. Great holy war. Uyghur win. Put it in the right folder. Sure, there. That works. Now, if all goes according to plan, when I hit the next month, I should get it. I don't even know where to begin. No mad agitation. You think? No mad agit. No mad agit. You just confirm. Fuck are you? I I wanna check this. Without that happening. So he has a title. might be the conclusion. Can't you start for someone who's at war? So he has a title. It's fine for him to be my vassal. Igbo 
bugged. Yeah, the other egg bugged. Let's see, Gobi. It's my realm. Tyrannosaur is my realm. So you're at war, so I can't usurp you. Well, let's just let it run for a few days and see what happens. Um. Okay, now I'm mad. Because November just came about. And I did not get my achievements. I have Protector of the Holy Places. I don't know that you can see my Steam community, nor that I would necessarily want you to. But I'm looking at the web browser in game just to see like what's going on here. And like did the game release a new patch or something? Northeast become king of Mongolia. Okay, so um, yeah, it's fine. This episode's going on longer than normal. If, if you want, hit the like and subscribe buttons, or whatever they say when this goes on. This is really actually a matter of frustration to me. King of Uyghur, Kingdom of Mongolia. I now have the title of Kingdom of Mongolia under my belt. My realm's gonna collapse if I don't get this next month. Like, you have no idea. Okay. Um. Is it that title that he has that I couldn't usurp earlier? He's still at war. I mean, I'm going to have to go on a little longer with my next episode. But I want to thank you for joining me, and as always on this channel, La Paz.